Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to create this beautiful infographic design. As we know, it is tough to design a triangle with rounded corners in PowerPoint. We will see an effective method to design it. So, let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and then format our background. Right click on the slide and then choose format background. Fill the background with some solid light color. Go to insert tab and draw circle holding down shift key. Align it to the center of slide and adjust the size if required. Make it no outline and then right click and choose format shape. Fill it with light grey color and then apply internal shadow effect. Adjust blur and transparency values until you get desired effect. Now format this shape with gradient outline. Make it a two-step gradient and match right side stop color with background. Increase its transparency to 100%. Next set left side stop color to white and increase its line width to 4 points. Adjust the gradient angle such that shadow and outline are opposite to each other. Go to insert tab and draw straight vertical line. Change its outline color to black. Duplicate this line using Ctrl plus D and rotate it by 60 degree. Since it will be 6 step infographic design, each line must be separated by 60 degrees. Again, duplicate this line, and this time rotate it by 120 degrees. We will use these three lines as reference to place our design elements. So, make sure all these three lines pass through center of slide. Next, go to Insert tab, draw circle through center of slide holding down Ctrl and Shift keys. Make it no outline and fill it with dark grey color. Now we will create a triangle with rounded corners in a new slide. Go to Insert tab and draw a triangle shape holding down Shift key. Make it no outline and increase its transparency to see through. Next go to Insert tab and draw moon shape. Make it no outline and place it between two sides of triangle shape. Adjust the width of moon shape and fit it perfectly between two sides of top corner. Change its solid color and increase its transparency to see through. Zoom in and make sure the moon shape does not cross both sides of triangle.
Now duplicate this moon shape using Ctrl plus D and rotate by 210 degree. Since each corners of triangle shape are at 120 degree apart and moon shape is already rotated by 90 degrees, total angle of rotation will be 210 degree. Similarly, make sure this moon shape fits between each corner sides. Continue in the same way and paste another moon shape at the third corner. Next, we will remove the extra portion of triangle which comes above each moon shape. Go to insert tab and draw rectangle exactly at the intersection of moon shape and the triangle sides. Similarly, do it for other two corners, and obviously, rotate each rectangle shape by 120 degree. Holding down Ctrl key, select triangle and all three rectangle shapes, and then subtract them. Next, select all the remaining shapes and union them. So that is how you get the triangle shape with rounded corners. Now cut and paste this triangle shape in slide number 1. Let's resize it and place it as per the design requirement. Now duplicate this triangle shape 5 more times and place it in a circular pattern making use of reference lines. But before we proceed, it is important to make sure, each triangle shape is at constant distance from the center. So, let's draw a circle exactly at this center of design. Make it no fill and change its outline color to white. Increase the size until its outline touches bottom most point of triangle shape. Now rotate the duplicate triangle shape and align it properly making use of reference line and as well as the center circle. Continue to duplicate this shape and arrange them in a circular pattern. Delete the reference circle. Next holding down control key, select middle circle and all the triangle shapes and then fragment them together. Change the fill color of each fragmented shapes.
also apply the internal shadow effect to each of these shapes. Next select the outer portion of each triangle shapes and apply outer shadow effect. Now go to insert tab, choose smart art and add cycle pattern with circles. By default, it has 5 circles, click on add shape to make it 6. Increase the size of the smart art until each circle fits properly on all 6 triangle shapes. Now ungroup the smart art 2 times and delete the connecting arrow shapes. Select all the circle shapes, and then holding down Ctrl and Shift keys, decrease their sizes. Next duplicate all these circles one more time, and change their fill colors. Align this duplicate set with the original set of circles, and again holding down Ctrl and Shift keys, decrease their size. Change the color of each duplicate set circles, and apply outer shadow effect to original set of circles. Delete the reference lines, and then proceed to add text fields and PNG icons. Let's speed up to save time. So here is our final preview. Hope you all liked it. 
please don't forget to like share and comment thanks for watching and stay tuned